Harley Quinn, Birds of Prey was fucking fantastic. Seriously, go see this movie. Now. Fucking now. Go see this movie. Right now. I love this movie so much, I'm seriously considering making it my Valentine. Well, either the movie or Huntress. I mean, she's beautiful, like, meow. Or should I say something like, Caca! This movie is a quintessential blend of action, comedy, and story. Director Kathy Yawn and screenwriter Christina Hansen do a great job of incorporating over-the-top action scenes that are not so over-the-top that they overshadow the story, but are still really freaking fun to watch. I seriously have to give these action scenes special attention because they truly do not feel like a traditional comic book movie fight scene, you know, that's filled with CGI and stuff like that. It just feels more like a kick-ass Tarantino movie, like, um... Something like Kill Bill or Reservoir Dogs, or I would go as far to say a John Wick film. Which, in retrospect, makes a lot of sense when you realize that John Wick director Chad Stahelski was brought on set to help create these elaborate fight scenes. The score by Daniel Pemberton was fucking awesome. There is no other word to describe the score than just awesome. Every single song in this score fit the movie and the scenes perfectly. It's every single emotion that the movie that the directors were trying to portray the music fit just 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 right it was awesome there's one scene in particular that comes to mind when I think about the music and that's when uh, Huntress was riding through the city on a uh, motorcycle and it was so reminiscent of the Dark Knight oh my freaking god it gave me the biggest nerd boner I still have the boner to this day, and I saw the movie like two weeks ago, guys. Mary Elizabeth Weinstein's Huntress was a surprising yet welcome scene stealer. Another show-stealing performance was Ewan McGregor's rendition of Black Mask. In my opinion, Ewan McGregor's rendition of Black Mask alone is a reason to see this movie. In addition, Chris Mazina's Victor Zaz was truly unforgettable. My only complaint with this movie is that we didn't get to see enough of the actual Birds of Prey. The movie definitely is a Harley Quinn movie, but that's fine, because she's Harley fucking Quinn. She deserves her own film. Plus, this movie sets up perfectly for spin-off films, for more Birds of Prey, you know, Harley Quinn and Poison Ivy, you know, whatever. It just sets up for more, definitely more DC female-oriented movies. Birds of Prey is an overall awesome film. Is it a kick-ass classic? No. Is it going down in history? No. Is it going to win any... You know, awesome awards? Nah, I don't think so. But, you know, it doesn't need to. It, it does a perfect job of being what it is, and that's okay. Because whatever the fuck this movie is trying to be, it's amazing. It's it's unique, filled with love, and a clear sense of passion from the cast and crew. I give this movie an 8 out of 10.